everyone welcome back to my channel home with me mrs k today i am bringing you the video that you have been asking for which is a brand new apartment house tour it is lovely and empty so i thought i'll show you guys around why it's spacious and there's no furniture so you guys can get a really good feel of how the new apartment looks it is sunday morning so i am trying to be super super quiet because it is really early it's about quarter past seven i've got all of the windows open and obviously where the place is empty it's really really echoey so I'm trying to be really quiet before the neighbours think that I'm just some lunatic that's randomly talking to herself about the apartment so I'm trying to be super super quiet so yeah like I say the apartment is lovely and empty so that's what I'm going to show you first and then I do need to do some cleaning bits around it has had a clean but you know how you just like to do your own cleaning where you know things are have been cleaned properly and um, so that's what I'm also going to be doing today um, and then after this i've also got a pop to ikea which i am so excited to do guys because okay if you have been watching me for quite some time you will know that i have a little obsession with my bookcase i'm just obsessed with it i love to style it around christmas time halloween autumn and easter and i just love it it's my favorite thing to decorate today okay we are going to get a new bookcase which i'm absolutely buzzing about because it's a double one, which means just more space to decorate wall shelves. So I'm absolutely so excited for today. Um, I know that doesn't sound quite normal, but I'm not quite normal anyway. Um, that's another thing you would have come to learn over time if you had been with me for quite some time. Um, so yeah, I'm so excited to get this video going. So yeah, let's have a look around the apartment, guys. This is the little fan we just let everybody in when they buzz up. And then literally as you walk in the door, this is what you will see so this is the hallway in here is a cupboard which is going to be very handy for us to use to hang our coats and things like that i'm thinking about putting shoes up here there's even another shelf up there so there's quite a lot of space in here and then in the cupboard we'll probably just put things like mops buckets hoovers stuff like that and then in these doors is where the front room is so i'll take you guys in here it's a very very spacious room as you guys can see i mean it's absolutely massive i don't think the camera really shows how big this room actually is guys it's absolutely ginormous it really is massive got some lovely lights on the wall let me show you those when you turn them on so they're quite funky quite modern i have to say it's a bit too modern for me but <laughs> love these i absolutely love this big door nice and bright it makes all of the light come into the room especially on the nice spring and summer days it's going to be really really lovely and bright in here lovely big window absolutely massive window again just brings in so much light and just makes the room so lovely bright airy and spacious um this is i think where we're going to put the tv so i'm going to put my tv unit there and then we're going to have like the couches here dining area which we're actually going to put here and then i'm thinking about putting my bookcase here because you guys know i love my bookcase so i have to find a place for that so i'm hoping that's going to look great there but we shall see once all of the furniture is in here properly this area here we are actually planning which you guys might find find a bit bizarre this is actually going to be our bedroom <laughs> But I have got some really nice plans for this. So we are going to put a double bookcase here, which will section off quite a lot of it. And then like a nice curtain thing here. But it will be kept private. There are locks on these doors. So if we did want to lock it and have a bit of privacy, we can do. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the bedroom area. So I'm thinking double bed here, chest of drawers here. And I'm thinking like a little makeup desk area here, which I think is going to be so lovely under the window really really love that there are curtain poles up here already and they are white which is bloody perfect for me so i've just got to take the measurements i'm hoping my curtains fit already that i've got in the front room because that will just save me some money but fingers crossed guys so this is the outside so we do have our own little balcony which is lovely as well it's a nice little size space to put a table and two little chairs as well and then we're going to decorate it for halloween so we're going to put some pumpkins out put some lights across here but as you guys can see it's really beautiful out here i mean it's maintained really well looked after 
really really lovely area that we're in as well so it's just lovely Victorian light up there absolutely gorgeous those are the garages there's a little birdhouse over there but yeah it's really really lovely some lovely roses downstairs there's only um, three floors so we've got someone underneath we actually met her today she's quite lovely a little old lady um, and then there's just yeah like one of a level so we are in the middle so let me take you guys back in um, we're actually coming in here today to do a big big clean so that's why I've just got all of the windows open all of the doors open make sure it's lovely and ventilated get all of the smells out and just give this a nice clean which I am really really looking forward to um, we've got electric heaters <sighs> not a big fan of the electric heaters because it's just gonna cost an absolute packet but it is quite warm in here like it feels like it's not going to be a very cold place so I'm hoping that we don't have to have them on that much but we shall have to see and um, let me take you across the hall and show you guys the other rooms in this cupboard there is nothing in here apart from a massive boiler tank <laughs> So a bit of a waste of a cupboard, so that was a little bit annoying. Um, in here, it's just a little down, I was going to say downstairs. This is all downstairs, Gem. There are no stairs. <laughs> just a little toilet. I'll just pop that there. I love that it's grey, so it's nice and neutral. I'm not loving these tiles, guys. I mean, these are lovely, lovely and grey marble, but I just don't like this. So what I'm going to do is head to One Below or Poundland and get them like, you know, the stick on tiles? and just sort of stick them around here. It should cost me a lot. It's only a small wall, maybe a fiver tops. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna come in and give this a nice clean, got a nice little grape line as well to match. Little dainty little sink. Um, and then over here is the kitchen. If you guys can see, there is a door as well. It's kind of like frosty glass to match the living room doors. I love that we've got this little bar area to have like a breakfast bar or something like that. But yeah, it's lovely and tidy, um, quite modern-ish, just some cupboards up here, a white cooker. This actually fell off when we came in, so that's gonna get fixed. Um, so that isn't really a problem. I'm not a fan of these. <laughs> I'm gonna try my best to cover these up, guys. I'm not a fan of those. But like I say, it's quite modern and I'm just, I'm not really a modern girl, as you guys will know, but I'm gonna do my absolute best try and turn this into like my style if I can. I actually haven't had a look in the cupboards yet. Is this this one even a cupboard? Does it open? Oh, it does open. Hang on guys. I thought that was like a show cupboard. Oh, great. So it's like a corner cupboard. Lovely. I'm thinking I could put all my glassware then and cups in there. That's quite handy. All of these cupboards are so sticky. So, so sticky. What's in here? That's a nice size as well, guys. I think that's just the extractor fan up there. I don't know if it is an actual cupboard. So yeah, they're quite clean, but I would like to give them a once over myself. Anyway, because I just like to do that. Now, this is the most important cupboard of all. So we have to check this out, guys. This is the cleaning cupboard, okay? So this is gonna be my pride and joy. And it's really, really nice size, a lot bigger than the one that we just had. So I'm going to be able to get tons of stuff in there. So I'm so bloody excited. And I love that this is on here as well. I can put all of my cloths and sponges in there. So it's just going to be great at space saving. Um, this is a washing machine and a tumble dryer. However, I don't like to do that. I hate using machines that are washing machines and tumble dryers. I just find that the drying time goes on for too long and it just drives me absolutely crazy because I only tend to have mine on for a few minutes. Um, but there is a gap here. Now, when I when we came to view it last time around, um, someone, oh, guys, someone is at the door. Did you hear it ring? Someone at the door. I'm going to answer it, guys. Hang on, hang on. Hello, the bouquet residence. <laughs> Just buzz Simon in, guys. The camera will show you the rest of the place. So, yeah, what I was saying was that is a, a cupboard quite grotty behind there, but I'll give that a clean. I'm hoping the tumble dryer is going to fit in there. So, yeah, that is the kitchen. Um, and then in here, should we go in here? This is the bathroom. 
So this is the bathroom. Nice big cupboard in there. That's a nice cupboard as well. Nice size bathtub. And then that's the shower head up there. And then this is gonna be Jakey's room. I love these big windows. So nice. And what I love about this room is look, the storage in here is bloody brilliant. Let me show you. I mean, look in here, these cupboards are to die for. I love those. So you can put all of these clothes in there and then you can even have stuff up on the shelf. So like his school shoes, his trainers and everything can go in there. So I love that. Save space already. You don't have to bring over his wardrobe or his chest of drawers because it's all built in. Lovely size wardrobe as well. I mean, look at all of that space. And then this one, there is just a little cupboard as well. So no idea what he's going to pop in there. Maybe his computer games and stuff. And then he's also got cupboards up here. I mean, storage in this place is just so good for an apartment as well. You would think it would be like really, really tiny. So the storage is just fantastic. Um, let me take you across here. So in here is Jessica's room. She's got the biggest room because obviously she's got the most stuff. She's got toys and everything like that. Um, so yeah, this is Jess's room. These windows are beautiful. So big and lovely. And then again, she has got a built-in wardrobe as well, which again is lovely, saves space. Open it up. So she's gonna hang all of her clothes along there. Shoes probably up there, and I don't know what I'm gonna put up there. And then down here, we're just gonna put actually some toys and stuff like that. She's already brought her teddy bears over. Um, this is Jessica's room. So yeah, this is the house tour. House, I keep saying house tour, this is the apartment tour. <laughs> Okay guys, so now you have seen the apartment, do let me know what you think, give the video a thumbs up if you like the new apartment, leave me a comment and let me know what you think about it. Thanks so much for watching today guys, bye!